Hi friends, it's Amy with Real Age Beauty. And today I'd like to put together a holiday look using just Laura Geller and number seven. So here we go. The first thing I'm going to do is use her tinted moisturizer, Broad Spectrum in beige 2000. And you may wonder why is she wearing red today? It's because I needed brightening up. And I'm sure you guys feel the same way sometimes when you want to look a little bit more refreshed and bright. You put on a bright color and it helps quite a bit. Plus the holidays are coming and I want to be cheerful. <laughs> so this is her tinted moisturizer, which I think is absolutely gorgeous. And it's going to um, protect my skin with SPF 30, which is really good. I'm gonna add a little bit more to certain areas before I move on in the tutorial. And I think that's great. My next step is that I'm going to use one of the palettes from her four palette holiday set, which includes, oh, it's so beautiful. It includes blush, highlighter, and three, one, two, three, four, five, six eyeshadows. And this one is called Command the Room. So let's see. I'm not really looking to command the room, but I think this is really beautiful. So I'm going to start out with a base. What I really like about this set, and as I mentioned, there are four of them, is that it really leads you through the steps of where to apply which products. So this was my base, this is my lid, this is my crease. So now I'm gonna go for my lid. And it's a beautiful coppery. I'm not gonna go all the way in because I want my eyes to look a little bit further apart as opposed to close together. And when you put darker shadow on towards the edge of your eyes, it creates the illusion of your eyes being further apart. So now I'm going to do the crease. I think that's a beautiful kind of a, um, I'm gonna call it a brick color, but it's a soft brick. It is gonna need some mellowing. So let me get a clean brush. I am really, really strict about cleaning my own brushes because I want my products to look clean when they go on my eyes. And so instead of using the brushes over and over again, I probably wash them about twice a week. And I have a tutorial for you if you would like to know how to wash your brushes. It's really easy. Okay, there's that. And now for the other side, this is gonna be the inner corner, outer corner, and then the line. So let's try that. For the inner corner, I have another brush that I'm gonna put right in here. The outer corner is what I'm a little bit most worried about because navy blue is not usually my friend, but I'm going to be brave and put it on <laughs> for you guys. The reason why navy blue is not usually my friend is because it kind of, you know, I have an olive skin tone and sometimes navy blue doesn't go so well with olive and effect and also the fact that I'm really kind of like um, more 
dark complexion, but hey, let's give it a try. I'll take my clean brush to clean it up. Actually, I like it. <gasps> I'm surprised. Okay, so now I'm gonna take my brush and go ahead and buff that out. Buffing is a really good way to blend. And I'm going to teach you another trick as well. I'm gonna take I think that's good, but do you see that it's coming out too far? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take some concealer and this concealer is by Benefit. It's called Boeing. And in my case, it's number five. So I'm gonna take my Boeing concealer with a clean brush and I'm gonna sweep it up here so that the edge of my eyeshadow doesn't come out too far and make me look um, well, it's gonna brighten up my look. Let's just put it that way. Do you see how that is? That's nice. For the last step, I'm going to use the eyeliner. Actually, I'm not gonna use Laura Geller's eyeliner right now, and here's why. Because if, if I were blonde or had red hair, this color would be fine for me, but I'm just gonna sweep my eyes with the number seven that I got in my number seven kit, which is black. Black goes with everything. I like that. And I, I really like that because it's not yet another color on my eyes. I am gonna put a little bit down here, just a touch. There, I like that. My next step is that I'm going to take the number seven mascara. It's called the, the Full 360 Ultra. And I got this in a set, a holiday set. And I'm really liking it. I will recommend that you put on more than one coat of mascara. But that's true with any mascara. I mean, Clinique, Lancome, Estee Lauder, um, any of them. I think it's really nice to have two or three coats of mascara to really bring your lashes out. You just have to be a little bit patient. If you hear my dogs barking, I apologize. I have the cutest dogs. One's a schnoodle and one's a morky. And for the most part, they're really cute. You know, like kids. Okay. There, I like my eye makeup. It's not too much, but it does look like I've defined my eyes. So for the next step, I'm going to, oh my goodness, did I bring something for my brows? I don't think I did. So what am I gonna do for my brows? Uh, in this tutorial, maybe I just won't do my brows because I don't wanna fake it until I make it because if I fake it, I'll break it. So I am gonna take though, there's blush in this beautiful palette and I'm going to take a brush and add some dimension to my, now that's a pretty blush. Again, this is Laura Geller and it complements the eyeshadow set. And lastly, it comes with a highlighter, which I'm a little bit scared of because 
it seems to be a little bit on the dark side for me, but what the hey. I'm gonna highlight. Oh, that's pretty. Did you see I kind of did it like a V? I like it. And lastly, I am going to put on some lipstick. I have two choices here. One is Laura Geller's Berry, and then one is, oh, I'm sorry, it's Brick. And one is the number seven, Berry. Which one should it be? Let's try the number seven because you haven't seen it before. Okay. This is a beautiful lipstick that feels really creamy. Well, this is my look. I hope you've enjoyed this as much as I have, friends. Thanks so much for watching. I'll do my eyebrows on the next video. And I'm hoping that you are having a great day and staying relaxed and taking great care of yourselves. Bye-bye.